Hello, this is Zach Perkle, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a GUI texture packs button. So you're going to need to open up your GUI in game menu.java, and you're going to go in and just copy the coding from one of these, or just copy in what I have right here. You're going to add a, it's going to say, you're going to add controller list, add, and then you're going to do new GUI button, and then 10, comma, or you can name this, this can be whatever you want. Well, as long as it's not already one of these. So I'm just using 10 because I know that there's none other in there. And if I add more, it'll still be fine. So then you're going to go over to the height. And um, I made mine 148. You might make, you could make yours, um, yeah. It's a little, there's a little bit more of a gap than there usually is with this way. So you could try taking it down a little bit. But it's kind of trial and error. So I'm just going to leave mine as set. And then uh, type texture pack, or you can put texture packs in here. That, or I'm just going to make a note where you can add a texture pack, but you can make this do whatever you want. So you can add like a quick game one, and you can even create your own GUIs, which I'm going to do in a different video. But so just put texture packs in there, and then we're going to scroll down here, and then where it says if GUI button ID equals equals 10, you're going to write MC dot display GUI screen, and then new. GUI texture packs and then this and then you're going to do a semicolon and you have to have it in these curly brackets so you got to put that in and then yeah so I'm going to actually put the coding in the, the description this time so yeah so that's about it um yeah uh I'll see you all later goodbye this is Zach Perkle signing off